Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Mayling. Let's talk about how I stay motivated during this whole pandemic, you know, during the coronavirus. Like, you know, all the gyms are closed. All the gyms are closed. And, you know, I just had to figure it out, like how to do it at home. So like, you know, um, if you guys seen my first video, I talked about like my weight loss, my weight loss journey, my, my health journey, you know, what I eat and stuff like that. So I try to like break it down for you guys. This time I'm just coming back and just, you know, like I know this whole coronavirus shit has um, messed a lot of people up in like terms of like, you know, like it could be financial, it could be physical, it could be mental, it could be anything, you know what I mean? So, like, I feel like we all need that that motivation to, like, you know, keep going. So, for me, it w my motivation was, yo, this shit is hella ratchet. Guys. I won't talk about it, I won't talk about it. But anyways, guys, during this whole pandemic was just, you know, like, it took me... It's still taking me till this day, honestly. I've started in 2017 with my weight loss, so this is just a breakdown for my new people on my channel. So I started on my journey back in April 2017. I weighed 267 pounds, as you can say. Um, but um, I weighed 267 pounds, and now I'm 167. So basically, you know, just eating healthy and, you know, like getting my shit together honestly guys i did not follow any freaking diet thing or whatever i did it all myself like i just started cooking for myself i basically took what people told me to eat five times a day and you know just drink water yada 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 um the way i stay motivated was you know it took me a whole like 17 months when i first started back in 2017 it took me 17 months to lose 90 pounds guys remember this is not an overnight thing this is not like yo let me wake up let me take this pill let me do this ah, ah, let me just drink shakes and blah 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 like no guys this is actually a lifestyle change you feel me so my thing was it was mostly like you know i changed my whole life up you know like i'm not gonna let like yo i'm not gonna lie guys let me put you onto a story real quick but like i'm not gonna lie at the beginning of quarantine my mom was like literally you need to stop eating and i'm like but I was walling, guys. Did y'all see my? Did y'all see my real hair? Anyways, but I was walling, guys. Like I was just eating cereal. Like I, Hector, if you're watching this, like you are my fucking witness. Like I was eating cereal at four in the morning, chips, chocolate. Chocolate is my all-time fave. Like if you guys, if you guys want me to love you, just get me chocolate. That's all you gotta do. But anyways, um, just walling in the beginning, and yo, so I had a dream, and um woke up the next day fucking crazy i walked into this mirror right here this mirror in back of me and i was big again like i was back at 267 i like grabbed my fucking chin and i just went like this and i was just like i was freaking out i had like a fucking panic attack so when i woke up i was just like i was like i'm gonna stop eating so anyways what motivated me was just like you know like my my journey it took a long time and you know there are some times and I, I don't want you guys to be hard on yourself there are times where you're gonna mess up and it's okay as long as you just tell yourself all right i'm walling i need to get back to it like it is what it is but anyways guys um i had that dream and i'm just like bitch you need to get it together i don't know how i'm gonna do it without the freaking gym my friend Luna, my best friend Luna, me, I was like, hey Luna, do you have resistance bands? Do you have anything to work out? And sis helped me. Like, sis gave me some weights and some resistance bands. So, Luna, you are my motherfucking guy. I started like that. Like, I started, I tried to run up the stairs, guys. It wasn't it. What a mask! Like, I was dying. I was like, you know when you breathe in the masses? I was like, nah. So what kept me motivated, guys, was just looking at my pictures. I'm my own goal, you feel me? I feel like when you start this off, it's cool to have, like, a picture of somebody. Or, like, you know, somebody motivational. Like, you always need some motivation. Because, listen, I know what, is, what it's like to need motivation. I was always the girl to tell my mom, like, yo, I need help to lose weight. Can you help me? Yada, yada, yada. You feel me? But it comes from within you so i was just like you know i worked very 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 hard to get to where i'm at today and i'm still working on myself you feel me and my motivation was just looking at my pictures and saying yo you dead lost 110 pounds you lost another freaking person so my motivation was just looking at my pictures and you know like i work out like literally like my life was literally work and going to the gym and then going home and then the same shit so 
I guess it was already in me. So, like, what motivates me, honestly, guys, I drink pre-workout to get a little more, like, because, you know, during the day, I'm just, you know, you're cleaning, you're doing whatever you, you're doing, and you need some motivation, and you need some a push. You know, it gives me that energy. I put some music on. I act like I'm in a concert while I'm working. Like, I'm working now and shit, and then I'm dancing at the same time. Like, yeah, yeah, you know, trying to act like, you know, trying to get hype for, like, my fans out there, you feel me? But this is me in my room, but... That's just what motivated me in my journey. I didn't want to take a step back to just to just remember why I started in the first place, which was no reason at all, guys. I just wanted to experiment, like I told you guys. I never wanted to lose weight to, for anything, for any freaking reason, but that was my motivation, just myself. So, and then also, you know, like, working out at home is fucking hard, guys. It's, like, it's hard, but it's so worth it when you're done. You know what I mean? Like, in the beginning of quarantine, I wasn't big, but, like, you can tell the difference between the beginning of quarantine and now, like. So, yeah, guys, so that's just what kept me motivated was just me, like, you know, my journey. I was like, I'm not going to take a step back. Let me get this on and popping. Let me get popping for next year because apparently we ain't leaving our house till next year. But I'll give you a little tips and tricks on weight loss so if you're trying to lose weight guys you need to eat anywhere from a thousand to a thousand and two hundred and you know you can still eat bread you can still you know eat the same way just what helped me a lot guys was my fitness pal i said this before my fitness pal it just i put everything i eat throughout the day and it just helps me track everything and that that app to this day is the best i don't use it anymore but like for the beginners like I totally recommend my fitness pal. I'm not, a, I'm not gonna tell you, I'm not gonna stress it enough how much you need my fitness pal because people think like, I'm gonna eat a salad, I'm gonna eat this, and then you get bored, you feel me? I feel like, I know people, yo, if I have, y'all see this freaking hit? Woo! Woo! But anyways, um, I feel like people lose track of like, you know, of, of it all because, you know, they're like, let me eat a salad, let me, you know, instead of just like writing it in, like just write what you eat from the morning all the way to the night and you're gonna see the difference as you keep you know, putting something different. Um, that's one tip. Tip number two is for people who are starting out in the weight loss journey, please do me one favor, like just one, just one. Please start off with your eating. Eating. You feel me? Eating is the most, it's literally, literally, I don't know why I said literally, it's literally 80%, you feel me, and 20% is legit freaking working out, working out could come at whatever time, but I'm telling you guys, work on your eating, work on your eating, start eating breakfast, start eating snacks after the breakfast, like two hours after, then two or three hours later, eat lunch, two or three hours later, a snack, two or three hours later, dinner, you feel me? If you guys want to do shakes and stuff like that, that's okay. Because, listen, I drink a lean shake. Lean shake is my shit. Like, for anybody who knows out there, I just started drinking strawberry, but that's not the point. So, I mean, that's another advice I could give you guys. Guys, I did not dye my hair. This is a wig. You feel me? Last advice I'm going to give you guys on weight loss is nobody could get in your way but you. Now, let me tell you something. Back then... I always used to tell my mother, I was like, listen, like, ma, I need help losing weight. I I can't do this by myself. I couldn't stress enough how stressful it was for me to lose weight. And um, well, my last advice to you guys is you are in, you are only getting in your own way. Blah, 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 just bit my tongue. You are the one getting in your own way. Get out of your head. Stop thinking about it. I know it may seem hard. And it is, trust me. Like, I'm not... Like, honestly, people be asking me about my journey. And they're like, what motivated you? Nothing motivated me. I was just broke as fuck. You know, I was going... This, this was around the time I was going to beauty school. And, you know, like, I wasn't working or anything. So, I'm just like, let me cook for myself. And there was, like, McDonald's. Pie. Everybody knows where Pie Chester is. I used to go to American Beauty School. Oh, grrr, what's up? Those are my people. But anyways, um, I used to go to American Beauty School and everybody knows in Pirate Chester there's hella fucking fast food. So it, was, it wasn't it was hard for me. Like, ask my beauty girls. Like, they were like, we don't know how you do it. But I used to cook for myself every day. Um, my aunt used to contribute. Like, she used, beans were my shit. If you look back on my videos, guys, again, I talk about what I eat and stuff. Beans were my shit. So all I'm going to say is, I think I already went off track. My bad, my bad guys. All I got to say is, you're in your own way. 
So get out of your head and just do the damn thing. You got this. You got this. So just a little bonus. Um, I hope that helped you guys. I hope that helped enough. You know, you know if it has to do anything with weight loss, like don't hesitate to write in my comments. I will answer your questions. If you guys wanted to see another video on weight loss or just like you need a little motivational speak from me, I got you. Just let me know in the comments. But I'm going to show you guys. That's my mama. So just like before I head out, guys, uh, I'm just going to share with you guys some snacks that you guys can eat. Because I know you guys ask me what like snacks I eat and stuff like that. And like, you know, I think I got a little bit of something for like all the lovers out there. For like, you know, there's the chocolate lovers, the candy lovers, there's the chip lovers, there's the whatever. You feel me? So this is just some things that I eat. And literally, guys, I have snacks like twice a day. So... Let's see what we got in our goodie bag. You already know GNC. That's the only place I shop at for my shit. GNC. GNC. Bad guys, I'm back. Back in the New York real. I'm back. I know. All right. Woo! Hold on, bitch. That shit is. So I think I have something for like everybody. So. I like variety these. Like I like took a break. There's a lot of stuff that I take breaks from because it's like when I like something, I don't know about you guys. I'm the type to overdo it. Like to this day, that was very unladylike. My bad. Anyways, guys, to this day, like I'm the type of person that like literally wakes up, eats the same fucking breakfast. In my first video, you will see me talk about the breakfast I eat, which is like a freaking sandwich every day and and a protein shake. I still eat that till this day. I know, guys. Like, everybody says that if the world ends, like, I'll be fine because I eat the same shit every day. Like, I'm, I'm good off of that. Like, I can eat the same shit every day. Anyways, long story short is I got tired of the bullshit. I overdid it, but, like, I bought it again because I'm like, I kind of want it. So, these are chips for my chips lovers. This is I want, I guess, and it's protein chips. Literally, again, guys, I get everything from GNC. So, like, I like ranch. They have different flavors. Um, there's other brands. There's Quest and all this stuff. But literally, this is my favorite, and it actually tastes really good. It doesn't taste dry. It doesn't taste plain. It doesn't taste nasty. But that's one. Um, I just all right. So, I think in my other videos, I talked about Sweet Smarts. And I love all sweet smarts. Like, I love the blue fishy one. I love um, just all of them except for the yellow one. But anyways, they came out with some new shit. I don't know about you guys, but I love Starburst. Like, um, let me show you this new shit. Let me show you this. Because you are a pink Starburst, my love. For everybody that knows me, I love Starburst. I love candy. Anybody that actually freaking knows me, I love candy. So, I came up across this. And this is also from Sweet Smarts. They're fucking popping. It's a woman-owned brand. Oh, grrr. Anyways. These are my new favorite shit. It doesn't taste exactly like um, Starburst, but this shit is motherfucking crap. And it's only 120 calories and it has mac candy in here. Um, for my chocolate lovers, so they have this. This is, what brand is this? MP Muscle Farm. Anyways, I like all my stuff with like either less sugar. Like this has three grams of sugar. This has God knows what, but it has protein and... You know, I'll be working on the yates. You feel me? Like, I'll be working on the yates. My thing is protein. And this has 10 grams of protein just to get my protein in. And these are like M&M's. Literally, this shit tastes like M&M's, guys. Literally tastes like M&M's. The best shit ever. They have different flavors. This is one of my favorite flavors. Um, and I think that's really, oh my god. I got some other shit, but I ate it, to be honest. I go to GNC. They have different stuff. And like everybody has different tastes you feel me so maybe you find something you like um and then this this is like i eat it at for lunch or either dinner i haven't had it in a long time because again guys i'd be walling like i'd be eating the same stuff all the time but i was craving it today and i was just like why not so this is also like for like a meal replacement if you guys want this is um mac and cheese muscle mac hella good hella good i wouldn't put you guys on to nothing wet but um yeah guys like i showed you my lean shake i drink that almost every day sometimes i even meal replace when i'm working or have time or anything i would just drink a lean shake by itself again guys if you guys want anything else for me like 
about weight loss just ask me and i wouldn't i wouldn't hesitate writing back in the comments so guys that's the ending to our youtube today i hope you guys learned something i hope you guys get some motivation you got this like yo this is your life you are living it you are the freaking author to your own life to your book guys i'm telling you you can change anything and even if it's not weight loss like if you want to change yourself financially or just spiritually or whatever lady you feel me um just you got this like the only person in your way is you don't let anybody anybody tell you you can't because you freaking can like period like you know what's your number one superpower nobody can be you so baby girl or baby boy you got this again like guys this is the ending to our video i always love coming to talk to you i am so sorry that i haven't been on youtube for a long time not out of garbage but you know i hope you guys saw my last video it was really nice you know traveling during the coronavirus had fun and you know i'm gonna try to get a video out to every sunday like i told myself i was like rochelle you gotta get back on your shit and you need to like talk to your youtube people because they're family too you feel me so i'm gonna come back on here guys as often as i can i can't wait for my next video because I it was at this moment that he knew wait for my next video guys because it's gonna be like with my friends and we're gonna get fucked up we're gonna get lit so i'm just waiting for that Ugh, i love getting fucked up in my friends but anyways guys i hope you guys have a good one i hope you guys got some motivation out of this or just you know like you need to put yourself first, guys. This is your life. You got this, guys. You got this. So, guys, again, like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you next week.